Hey y'all, it's Monday morning, February 22nd, and we welcome you to another edition of This Week at AMG. Thank you for joining us today. It is always our joy to share with you uh, what God is doing around the world. And today we are going to take a look once again at our leprosy ministry in India. AMG has been working in India for uh, 40 years now, and we have seen God do incredible things. We have been able to come alongside poor children, uh, old people in need, leprosy sufferers who have faced rejection from uh, society. And God has used the ministry of AMG India to touch lives, to draw them to Him. And uh, the fruit throughout the years has been amazing. Last fall, a couple of us from AMG USA had the privilege to go and visit the ministries of AMG India and to see the leprosy ministry firsthand. We are going to show you a little video from uh, that visit. And uh, please, when, as you see it, remind yourselves to pray for AMG India's ministry to leprosy sufferers, to some of the most unfortunate people on the face of this earth and pray that God will continue to use that ministry to touch lives with His love and draw people to Him. We are at AMG's Bethesda colony it is a colony for leprosy victims and we just had uh, the privilege of with worshiping some of them and to see uh, the joy of the Lord in many of their faces as they have come to know the Lord the Savior. It's really special to be able to spend some time with uh, leprosy victims because of the stigma of the disease. They are not allowed to stay with other people. While leprosy is cured, the effects on their bodies cannot be reversed. There are so many that are missing fingers and uh, you can see their faces have been disfigured by the disease. And uh, it really feels like we are back at the time of Jesus. And we are privileged to be among some of the leprosy sufferers that are helped through AMG. AMG has been working in India for uh, more than 40 years now. And one of the big ministries is to help leprosy sufferers following the example of Jesus, who came and touched them and uh, did the unthinkable. Uh, it was unclean to touch a leper in those days, but Jesus came and touched the leprosy patients of his day and cleansed them. And it is because of his love for all of us that we are able to follow his example and come here and touch the lives of these leprosy sufferers. It's the exact same people that Jesus ministered to in his day and we are privileged to be doing that today. These individuals really need help because they face rejection from others in society. It is uh, really a privilege for AMG India to come alongside and, and be able to help them. We are grateful to be taking part of that. It's also very exciting to see many of them come to saving knowledge of Christ. A, a little while ago uh, it was exciting to see them sing and clap their hands and praise the Lord and uh, to hear from some of them how they came to know the Lord and how the Lord has worked in their lives. So in addition to getting physical help, they also have found spiritual help, they have found uh, salvation in Jesus. I asked her how she came to the Lord. She married a leprosy patient in our colony and uh, when she came to the colony and uh, she lived there, she listened to the word of God and God spoke to her. We had the opportunity to meet one of the leprosy sufferers in this colony whose uh, daughter has actually been able to study uh, with AMG's help and is now in medical school and is uh, going to be a doctor and care for others in this uh, uh, society. And it is really, really special to see people who would not have had another chance to be given an opportunity to show the love of Christ and to see the love of Christ transform their lives for this life and for eternity. Uh, there is nothing better than that to know that uh, there are people that uh, can be equipped to earn a living, to live a normal life, and then to be 
after this life in a place where there is no more pain, no more crying, and no more sorrow to be with Jesus. So we are grateful for giving the opportunity and the privilege to minister to them. It costs approximately $35 a month to care for a leper sufferer, to provide what they most need, the clothing, the food, the uh, care that uh, they need to survive every month. And it's a very small amount to make a difference in their life. Once you join me in praying for this AMG ministry, that God will continue to use it to make a difference in the lives of the leper sufferers, that they will continue to experience the love of Christ, that they will uh, uh, grow in their faith uh, in Christ, and uh, for those that still don't know Him, that they will come to serving knowledge of Christ. It truly is a privilege to minister to leprosy sufferers following the example of Jesus who reached to the leprosy sufferers of his day. It is a unique opportunity. Please be praying for this ministry and particularly for the financial needs to continue to do it uh, month after month. If you would like to know more about it, please visit our website at www.amginternational.org or give us a call and we'd be happy to tell you more about it. Well, that's it for this week, and we hope to see you next week, this week at AMG.